I'm not gonna lie, this weather is banging in it, bruv. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I might be a bit, I might be a bit tipsy, but you know that Santan Dave, yeah? I reckon I'm gonna be Santan Dave. You ready? Oi! Sunshine in the GB, that's crazy. I got pins in my beaker, Tracy. To say I ain't really a wasp man, but I got love for bees like I'm Jay Z. Legs out top off, corner shot, stop off. Buy one, get one free. Now that's bog off. Sweet one in a sundress, wanna do me, but I always use protection like UV. Walk in the park, dogs wanna bark. This ain't a sweat patch, it's just a mark. Old white lady said I look dark, dashed her like a frisbee just for a lark. The grass is green, wow. sky is blue. Wow. Me and my N words, BBC News. Nah. Gonna get waved like a man on a cruise. Anchors on show, too hot to wear shoes. Ashy, dry. Apply Vaseline to the knees, hit him with the left, right, left, right, left, right, right, finish off with factor 50, take one sniff of the armpit mango, ooh, ooh, like D double E, and if an MC try trouble me, oh, yeah. he'll get licked, knobbly bobbly. M. Huncho, the music artist and distant cousin of Rey Mysterio, released a mixtape, but who is the man behind the mask? There are two things we know about Martin Huncho, he loves mystery and he loves girls. Who else loves mysterious girls? Mysterious girl, I wanna close to Coincidence. I think not. Next, M. Huncho's song Thumb refers to him popping his thumb into someone's bottom like a pound coin in a Tesco's trolley. I found another man who seems to be constantly putting his thumb into an imaginary bum hole, Jeremy Corbyn. What if, after losing the election, Jeremy Corbyn turned to a life of music and bum thumbing in order to sustain his playboy lifestyle? Coincidence? I think not. Finally, the people on M. Huncho's mixtape cover. What are they thinking about? Nate is thinking about money. Hedy is thinking about Brexit. Young Ad is thinking about... My name's Oscar, I'm a, I'm a carer here at the Rap Retirement Home, uh, the perfect place to uh, wrap up your career. We do quite a few activities here for the old people, uh, choir in the booth led by Father Fredo. It's funny, he used to say, um, never feed the bad as pasta, uh, and now he's become one, so we've also got uh, Hardy Caprio, although we call him uh, hard of hearing Caprio because he's a bit deaf, but uh, he likes to read the newspaper to us most mornings. I suppose he's our very own uh, Trevor McDonald. We've also got Chip, little Chippy. We managed to get him down to uh, 50 cigarettes a day, which is good. He will actually spend most of the day meditating. So, you know, Chip Monk has become sort of Chip Monk. Tion Wayne's popped down from the nine a few times. We call him Weon Wayne actually because of a few accidents he's had, but it's funny. The biggest thing you walk into the British Embassy and you say, Adi Madadi, free up world boss. No, you're trying to get a British passport, not a serving of rice and peas. <laughs> Look, if you want to pass a citizenship test, you need to know about British culture. You know, I used to eat at the Piccadilly Circus uh, with my family. Do you mean you shared a packet of quavers from Boots? Yeah, yeah, kind of. <laughs> right, look, I've made a list of questions they could ask you. So, the British national anthem is called God Save the... I don't know. The Queen. Oh, man, yeah. And the Queen is part of... Destiny's Child. No. The royal family. I think you'll find most members of Destiny's Child are actually under the age of 146. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Okay, what British bird is named after the colour of its blue chest? Blue jays? No, blue tits. <laughs> <sighs> what was Margaret Thatcher known for? Shape and curves and bo- Has your trim gone from bag tidy to Tion Wayne? Is your hairline less masterpiece and more McDonald's logo? Do you miss the warmth of your barber's ball sack on your knee? as he sculpts your shape up, or then you're suffering from traumatic trim disorder, and we can help. With Trimstagram, the app where dudes can discuss their dutty trims together. Whether you look like an Easter egg or an escaped convict, you won't be judged, because our community is tighter than a white woman's cane rose. Although you won't see any women clapping their cheeks covered in Cravendale, the app comes packed with features. Spend hours trying on virtual trims, or practice your patois, ready for your next trip to the Afro Barbers. I just learned a new word! Blood cat. Save yourself the hassle of looking like a white supremacist and don't shave your hair. We like it just the way it is. Trimstagram. We're all in this together. Hi, my name is Ivan Donsabit. I am Theresa May's dance tutor. And today I will be teaching you to dance like Mostak. Mostak is a very famous rock star. He has worked with the likes of Creep and Cornman. So the first dance I will be teaching you is the eviction notice dance. So imagine you are walking into a council estate and the poor people, they come up to you and say, Oh no, my area has been gentrified. Who is going to be evicted? And then we go up to them and we say, You are your mother, father and children. The next move we are going to learn is the brush your pony dance. When you have a pony, 
it is very important that you keep it clean. So all we're going to do is grab our brush and then we brush, 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 brush so that it is nice and clean when we run off the poor children. And now we will finish with the bunch of the poor children dance. Imagine that you are walking, walking, walking with your Prada bag and then all of a sudden you see a poor children. Mr. Willie. Wiley. Wiley, sorry. Now, as you know, schools are now closed. No way. Yes, it's awful. And so we're desperately looking for private tutors. Uh, do you have any teaching experience? No, I don't. Right. I'll tell you what I do know. I know what's a bumper hole and not. Well, I'm not sure I've read anything by bumper holes. Let's move on to the next bit of the interview. General knowledge. Oh my God, no! <laughs> Don't worry, they're all very roadman friendly. Uh, question one, who built the pyramids? The Italians, the Egyptians, or the Ghanaians? It wasn't built by any of these people. It was built by me. Right, and question two, can you name America's first black president? Tinchy Strider. And finally, who was Nelson Mandela? Woman. That sound like it went great, does it? Oh, well, don't worry, Mr. You know you can't stay here. You'll never take me alive. I, I'll, call, I'll call Grandad. He's got a leaf blower. I'm gonna smack the shit out of him. Uh, okay, can we not put Brian in a Rizla, thank you? But you? Can't you just... Niggas talk a lot of shit, but that's after I'm gone, because niggas fear me in the physical form. Let it be known. Thanks, Kendrick. Now, look, if you're gonna hide here, you can't just watch telly. Who gonna stop me? I am, actually. You a bitch. And you're watching Homes Under the Hammer. What are you, a 78-year-old widow? No, I'm gangster. Well, you dress like you're in a K-pop band. <laughs> but you know, we move. Let's just write this CV. What are you good at? I ain't gonna lie, I suck feet. Like, I'll be sucking feet. Okay, well, I'm trying to get you a job, not an audition at Pornhub. So, what else? Can you sing? <laughs> when you're ready, Susan Boyle. You gotta, you gotta when you on the phone. Forget this. I'm just gonna go and FaceTime my nan in Zimbabwe. Shout out Canada, shout out Montreal. It's in Africa. <laughs> this ain't a plain song. It's a remain song. Are you gang? Wednesday morning and I'm chopping up some carrots because we don't have coriander anymore. We used to get it from abroad This is the first time that we've been out of Europe since a war New country good, new country good But that EU will make you feel safe Like I could be in Norway Could get my visa in a day New country good, new country good But that EU will make you feel safe France, Italy and Spain Instead of Brexit just remain Talking on the net you got a voice now Bird leave and now you wanna make a choice now Tell your friends keep that it Says here you've had a UK number one single So you're a pop star I'm not a pop star Well, whatever you are, you're in trouble £50,000 in cash and a weapon in the car Wanna tell me what that's about? Let me just see how I feel after this peppermint tea you Don't serve that in prison I'm afraid How about some water and beetroot? That don't look like the kind of beat I'm looking for right now. You... Excuse me. Yo, bro, the feds are on me, bro. I need you to fall back. Right, listen here, you froggy little felon. You're going to talk unless you want to spend the next 12 years of your life sat in a prison cell, freezing your little plums off. I never even knew you could freeze fruit. Yeah, well, you can. And soon it's going to be too cold to even tickle your own... <laughs> Excursion. Excursion. Can't roll out with the man them, cause the vice might murk him. Trying to make strawberry smoothie, but the blender ain't working. Yeah. Bad man a chef, I meant lasagna, you were on Instagram twerking. Yeah. Whipping that quinoa, whipping that lentil. Yeah. Ain't been out for a week now, going a little bit mental. Oh, oh, oh. Have you seen this? It's got the littlest circles. Yeah. Finished all the normal tea bags, now I'm drinking that herbal. Mm -hmm. Tangerines. You know, whipping that citrus yeah, yeah, yeah. Cleaned all the pots and pans Can't believe that I did this yeah, yeah, yeah. Made casserole for the gang So I'm gonna need a big dish mm, mm, mm. Never see me eating sweets I'm a chocolate man like Idris yeah. Grab it and swerve it, turn it Try not to burn it It's unknown tea, Homerton B I've got galley on me Black 
face mask, but I don't sneeze. But I wear one in case a policeman sees. If one of you try and cough near me, you better cover your mouth with a clean hand key. Hot lem sip and a herbal tea. Quick daddy lee into A and E. Yes, you might be a G, but you don't need peace to go and see a GP. I'm a bad man, still wear PPE. Wear a little mask in Aldi. My nostrils moist and my lips wet. CO2 every time man breathes. You might be a man with a uni degree, but you've got asthma and low vitamin C. So use a mask or you'll see red like man you in the Champions League. Have you got a mask? Man's been wearing all that. I just gotta ask. Germs everywhere and all that. I just did a gasp. Tame up for air and all that. This shouldn't last. Just gotta stay wearing all that. They should have been. God, it's GRM Daily. We're here at the Grimm headquarters and we're going downstairs to link up with the Mandem. Come on, let's go. Yeah, but the first. Hello! Oh my god, Dino! Long oh. time no see, Roadman! What one? Roadman. Yeah. Nice to see you taking a break from killing small children in Sheila's oh, story. Nice. So, you seem to be producing a bit of music yeah. uh, with two Russian fellows by the looks of it. Yeah. Anyway, fellas, keep up the hard work. Not long now until you have to go back. You did drill. I do hardcore drill, obviously. I wouldn't yeah. suggest it's not for children. I, I must admit, I did expect there to be more Mandem in here, maybe, you know, Fredo Frog or David here to celebrate Funky Friday, which is an absolute tune, by the way. What are you cooking up in the studio? We've got some bangers, bro. Always bangers. More bangers than a Cumberland Sausage Factory, some might eat. Because you're my guy, and I mess with you, why do you hang around backstage, mingle with the artists, and do a bit of networking? Like yeah. a real life LinkedIn almost. Yeah, exactly like that. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay, well, I'll head off. Yeah. If you need me, I'll be sandwiched between two BBWs getting lean off the Henley. <laughs> what, what's, what's the Henley? Raw! <laughs> Sorry, I just wanted to sneak up on Sneak Bow. <laughs> Big fan of your work. Yeah, 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 yeah. Love that tune, man. Keep it active, okay? Raw! A real life BBW, Miss Bonks. Hey, you know what? They call me Mr. Bonzo. So, how about you and I open an ICER account together?